Hey FIRE students, it's Ben, your first year instruction librarian, here to share our second library video for the FIRE program. Today I'm with Wendy Jo, your business librarian, joining in the fun. Hi there! This video will introduce you to our discovery service, which pulls together many of the resources you are already familiar with into one search interface. We think you're really going to like using it. It's kind of like one-stop shopping for your research. One way to access it is from the FIRE Research Guide underneath the Find Articles tab. Let's take a look together. Okay, what's a good topic for us to search today? I actually thought of a topic when I was driving into work this morning, so my commute is really long and it's got me thinking a lot about self-driving cars. I could get so much done. That's a great topic for research. I keep hearing about them in the news, so I'm sure there's a lot of information out there for us to sort through, including information from books and newspapers and journals. The Discovery Service would help make that easier by searching the results from many of the library's databases and the library catalog at once. Look! Yeah, we can see from the results on the screen that we've found books, periodical articles, academic journal articles, even some podcasts. We got over 17,000 results back. That's a lot of information. Where does it all come from? We can actually check by looking at the filters on the left side of the screen. See down here? This shows a list of the content providers, the various databases that the Discovery Service is searching in. Wow, that really saves us a lot of time. Without it, we'd have to search each one of these databases and the library catalog individually. Yeah, and the other filters can be really helpful too. We did get a ton of results. Can the filters help narrow those down for us? Yeah, I often limit by source type, especially if I have specific requirements for my research. For example, I might want to look only at news articles. That did change the results a lot. In business research, we often need the most current information available. Another useful filter is by publication date. Let's limit our results just to within the last four years by using the sliding bar. That really does allow a lot of control over your search. We've narrowed down our results to be more specific and more efficient. In our next video, we'll get into some more advanced search strategies that you can use with the Discovery Service. And in the meantime, don't forget you can always reach out to Ben and I for help. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next time.